Hey guys, Copper Queen here and welcome back to episode 2 of season 1 of The Walking Dead. Last episode we left it off just before we go take on the bandits. Uh, we had a word with everyone. Our entire group other than Doug and Ben have been have joined us at the farm. They left Doug and Ben behind because Doug ate all the biscuits. That's a bit cruel, but at least Doug has a gun. So he might be able to hold himself, but if the bandits arrive, then they're not in for a good time. But anyway, let's not worry about them until things happen later on down the line. We've not got Clem's hat yet. Did, wait, I, I, Fellas, did she have a hat on I last episode? Late, but I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. It's uh, fine. We should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. You probably Who got the a fuck squeaky are these face. People in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work in the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yes. Let's go. Yeah, we gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Good Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. But she ain't got no hat. I'm sorry, Clem. Are you going now? Yeah. yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. I love you. Please be lucky. I will. Uh -huh. Not as lucky as that rabbit from the last episode, though, that got itself eaten. Definitely didn't want that foot. Don't worry, Clem. I'll be back. I'm gonna save the world. I'm gonna kill every zombie. I'm gonna save the world and make things go good. Don't do this game. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Not responding for a second. It's terrifying when that happens. Okay, let's do this. See anything? Not yet. Lots of trees. I don't trust I this it's brother. Here. It's gotta be close. He seems a bit evil. His face and he's like, let's go get him. It's very Oh shit. You found it? it? Reminds me of the Joker a little bit. How does everybody know like military signals and stuff like that? I'd be really terrible in situations like this. <laughs> Shh. Oh, am I am I sneak up on the camp? Okay, let's look out for anything on the floor, just in case they may have like been dug smart and got wires and stuff. They got sticks, they got food. You see anybody? Just you. Uh, stay on guard. On stay guard. on your guard. Charlotte. His gun's name is Charlotte. Watch my back, Lee. Shh. I'm gonna check out the tent. If there's anything in there, scream in your head. Don't alert anyone, okay? Okay. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's I... what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. I reckon they're on your farm right now. Let's have a look in the pot. Well, let's have a look in the kettle. Just water. Well, yeah, you kind of have to boil the water in case you know. That's what I've seen them doing in The Walking Dead. They've been boiling the water rather than uh, just drinking it straight. So, does it mean the virus can be passed on through like, there's a wasp at the window. It's gone, don't worry. If it came in, I would have freaked. Anyway, um, does it mean the virus can be passed on? Because last episode I asked about, like, you know, wildlife eating stuff. Like the uh, zombie bodies and things like that. So if they're boiling the water, yeah. the virus must be able to be passed on that like way. someone's been eating out of these recently. Just, why haven't the dogs or the bees or anything been infected? My bandage is coming off. 
Nothing. Don't worry, Lee, we got this. Nothing over there. Anything in this box? Head, shoulders, knees or toes? Empty. Anything? <clears throat> Don't be doing anything silly now. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Why did you move it? Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Why did you move it? There was no need for you to... Why did you do that? I don't understand your logic behind this. There's nothing on the table. Why would you move the box? What have you gained other than revealing more table? You worry me, Lee. You've done something. I don't know what you've done and I don't like it. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Oh, because they got a chair? Dude, my legs get tired from time to time too. I like sitting down. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Save lots. Move lots. Have a look at these boxes. Anything? Anything we can numb? I reckon they're all empty. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? A couple of empty cans. Uh, not unless you need empty cans. Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. You need to stop <laughs> being loud. If you've not learned anything from this whole experience, Lee, stop. Why are you moving? Ah, oh, St. John's Dairy. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. That ain't what good. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I don't trust I him. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. You are not my most trusted or favorite person, creepy joker wannabe. I really don't trust him. I really don't. There's something suspicious about this family now. Are they cannibals? Are they going to eat us? Are they going <gasps> to... They're going to serve us up Mark. This isn't their camp. This isn't their camp. This is certainly not their camp. This was somebody else's camp. That's a skull. Is it? Oh. The hell? Don't you fucking move. Shit! Put your guns down. I ain't going back. If you tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had to deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet. Put your damn guns down! Oh, so you can shoot you us now? I won't kill you. I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What, what the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. For oh. What 
just happened. God damn it! Um. Well, thanks. I don't want to get on his bad side. He's gonna well, shoot me. Welcome. I guess. <sighs> thanks for shopping at Save Lots. Great achievement there. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. I don't trust this family. Especially this guy. She's saying that they're gonna do something, tell us the truth and stuff like that. That's what he's, she was saying and they're planning something for us. I did see another axe in the background, but I guess we ain't picking that up. So if I shot her, would he have trusted me? But that could have also made me look like a murderer to him. I didn't Man, want to kill anyone. A hell of a ride, huh? I don't trust Jesus, you. Says Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on Maria. Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. Where is everyone? This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Who's Terry? My husband. Okay. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Hmm. Don't mind them. It's just how they are. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger just talking. Show we all get a little test. The weak we'll chain there. Shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. They got going on. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. I found your hat! How did that woman get it? Okay. <laughs> Close the door. Bye, Lee. Seriously, your magic pants. Where did you put the hat this time? <laughs> you could have just put it on. I don't, I really don't trust this family. I don't, I just don't. No, I don't want to speak to her. Let's not do that. I'm lazy. Let's look at the house. Okay in there. He's currently being chopped up and served for dinner. I'm telling you now. They're gonna feed him to us. I don't trust anything that's going on. Hello. Hi. Glad I got to use her today. Good old Charlotte, right? Girl here. You really like that gun. This place is isolated. You run in you run this place with just one cow? You really like that gun. Oh god, maybe What's I shouldn't have said not that. To like? uh, it's just, just, a, just gun. a gun. That's where you're wrong. This, this is Charlotte. Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. Oh. This place is isolated. Pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many I visitors? Don't like Not him. anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Oh god, the cooking mark. Oh, I ain't down for this. I'm not a cannibal. Even though I was talking about eating zombies in the last episode. I ain't no cannibal. I don't want- I don't fancy- <gasps> What happens if they serve up duck? Oh god, he may be daft, but I don't think he's- 
He's he's gonna actually take like take taste like duck. I'm really concerned. I don't trust them. Summit's going down. Summit suspiciously creepy is going down, and I think these bandits looks like a feeding station for the cow. Are protecting this farm. I have a feeling, and we were meant to die and be served up a supper. Let's go and speak to the guys. Hello. That was a spooky loud. That could draw in some attention. Is it okay? Hello. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. I want to hug her. It's okay. Go ahead. Don't need to look to me for advice, kid. Do what you want. This is your world, too. No. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. Oh, she's pregnant. We'll see, Clementine. Nice. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? Did you lick it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> gross, kid. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. She's pretty adorable, I agree. I ain't gonna give you a hat just just yet. Just she hold looks on a few. Skinny. Hey there, Andy. Yep. How's the cow? How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. I thought you were Kenny, to be honest. Um, when do you think uh we might eat? Mark. Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. It's Mark. Oh, that guy's leg. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. My suspicious is, suspicious is suspicions Have raising. I no, not really. Hmm, <laughs> it smells funny in here. Dude, there's cows in here. Well, like manure. <laughs> What's manure? Duty. <laughs> <laughs> Kids. She good. I like how she remembered that from the last episode. That's phenomenal. Anything? It, there is good oats in here. Anything worth looking at? Back up out of there. There's some good oats in there, though. That cow should not be going as hungry as it is. And here, even more. Even more oats. It's gonna be like a summit dead in here, isn't there? Oh no, just boxes. Hmm. Oh, I can actually look at things. I guess I was backing out too fast. Dairy products. Empty. Huh. Let's leave and have a look back at um, maybe one of the stalls or something. It's locked. You found it too, huh? Hey, Kenny. Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff, something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. I agree. How about you? What about Clem? God, I love that kid. I'll protect her no matter what. She's not actually family. I'll protect her no matter what. I love what. that kid. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. Dude, no. Back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. We'll eat first. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. A simple lock. Oh. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. I wouldn't Why say would I know how to pick a that? lock. Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened after right. food right Seems like you got a plan i'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow 
Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. No, Danny's the Can creepy one. I help you one. boys find something. Hi, Andy. Got any toys? Can't you hear noise? Just checking out the barn. Just Wait. checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. We need something to unscrew it first, buddy, so don't start getting any daft ideas. Let's have a look if there is anything in here. Salt lick. Da -da -da -da. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, hay. Hay there. I want to put in the hay. Okay. Just okay. stay close to your mom for now. Uh, okay. Oh, wow. Sorry if you heard that. My stomach is grumbling. <laughs> Doug, I want to play in the hay. Stop being silly, Doug. Go and sit with your mother. Uh, let's have a look in here. There could just be stomach lying around, you know. I'm guessing that cow has won a lot of first, second, and third place prizes. Okay, there ain't actually nothing in this one, so that's good. We didn't miss anything important. Monkey dokey, let's have. Oh, there's more to have a gander in. Moo to you, too. That was like the weirdest angle ever. Nothing in this one. You never know, there could just be a screwdriver sitting around and then we don't need to like hack off the door with an axe. Though I don't trust doing that whilst he sat in here. Hmm. It's a feeding trough. Full. It's a full feeding trough. Like those cows are pretty decent right now in terms of food, kind of. Maybe they can go through that in a day. I don't know. Whoa, Nelly. Um. That's people's stuff. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Like a chicken? Okay. Let's. I don't really trust anything. Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. How the heck did he see us? Oh, I'm just going to climb a hat back. Kenny, we'll talk later, okay? How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Oh, <laughs> here's your hat. Here, Guess what I found. Da, 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 da. You found it. Yeah, it was stolen. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. <laughs> I'm a hero. Yes. Did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? <laughs> Not in this world, no. I'd like to someday. I haven't thought about it in a while. I'd like to I'd someday. Like to we'll someday. That. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, Aww. thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clint. Gosh, Do you I want, want to give her a hug. Cow with me? Yes. Yeah, but you go on ahead. <laughs> okay, no. I'm gonna leave. I don't trust what's going down. Kenny, follow me. We need to talk. Okay, don't. I just don't trust what's happening. Oh. <laughs> He's... Oh, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. Eat Larry's the fattest. Lots of hay. Lots of hay. Of these might work as adequate cover for marrows if that becomes a problem. Who's that? Oh, that's Danny. Uh, I don't like him. He knows I'm suspicious of him. I really don't like him. I guess I should really speak to Larry, speaking to the mum. But Larry's trying to get in there and he's probably going to give me a really bad name. Just saying. He's going to be like, oh yeah, that, um, that Lee guy, murderer. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There's something odd in the barn. There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? 
if you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. Mm. What, what were you and Kitty arguing, arguing about, about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. Did that arm go through my chest? He um, does he treat you does like that too? You like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that, but he's not a bad guy. He just—he's got a lot of pain. Oh. He's been through so okay. much and lost pretty much everything, and it's hardened him, you know. Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself and me. All he's got left in the world is me, and that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him, and don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad, and I love him. I guess, but... After what Kenny told me? I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide yes. us. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. Yeah, I what you guys think out. of. Watch yourself, Lee. As much as I hate you and Larry, I need you guys, I think. Larry might come in useful. I mean, seducing the mother the way he is, that might save us some time. But he will throw me under the car the first chance he gets. Or under the bus, whatever the term is. He will throw me under everything the first chance he gets i'm not walking through this fence come on um lily i'm reckoning is probably going to be a pretty good shot after carly i think i'm probably better i don't know i feel like these guys might s actually do good for us maybe even though i we'll, really uh, hate larry we'll finish talking later yeah he was bad mouthing me i can tell i can tell you that right now you've been getting along with larry <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? He uh, trying to get some know out of you. If I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. Hmm. How's Mark How's doing? How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing or two about this being dead, tough. isn't it? I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Please don't eat, Mark. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? Yes. I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Hmm. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. She's clueless to what's really going down. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? It means you can't trust them. Any of them. I think I'll go have a look around. Kinda peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters crying against the fence before too long. I do not trust any of them. I don't think the mothers is in the loop as the two brothers i think she has an idea what's happening i just don't think she knows entirely what's going down uh i think they fed her a lot of false things as well i guess mark and i were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on i agree i guess i've already looked at the fence i don't really let's have a look in this they said i can use their stuff i'm using it it's a small toolbox Probably has um, some screwdrivers I can take or pliers, I guess. That should be handy. 
Or multi tool. Oh, I'm just gonna c continue looking at it. It's gonna burn darn handy. Okay, let's take that. Yeah, I agree. Because we got things in the back to look at. We just need the brother to get out. How can I get him out? How can I get the brother out? Just so I can have a gander. Uh, let's go and talk to Kenny. Kenny might have an idea. Maybe I can give Kenny the pliers. Somehow get, like, law the brother out. I reckon. Kenny, buddy! Want some pliers? Or do you want to leave the brother out? Like, give me a tour of the farm. I found a multi tool. Think something I think could help with the lock. All right, good here. Uh, but I need you to lure the brother out. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Outside of the barn. Uh, hey, Larry's talking to your mother. He's trying to get in there with hey her. Hey there, Andy. Yep. Um. Danny mentioned he needed you for something. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. I gotta be freaking quick. I'm scared. Come on. I wish there was a run button, but 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 it's not happening. Okay, come on. Okay. Things are gonna go Let's to hell this. quick. False alarm. I'm back. Damn it! Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Um. Where'd you keep your tools? So. Where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. Why'd you lock the door? Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff, even with the fence. Danny needs Daddy something needs again. Something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Right, he's gonna come back. We well, you know. D can you do something? He's gonna come back in. I'm gonna try this, and he's gonna walk straight the back in. You know this. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Your mom needs something. Get out. <laughs> come on. Damn it. Oh man. Who? Who? What could I do? I have no ideas. My problem solving is not happening very good. I think I've looked around this farm like Having a fair a decent amount. Like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Mm. Oh, I got it. I got a terrible idea. This is like the worst idea I could have, right? Can you walk through the fence, please? Ah, oh, Nelly. Power switch. Is there anything else I could do to it? Access panel. You got a multi-tool. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. I got a multi-tool. Come on, let's do these things. Let's be really naughty. There you go. Oh, man. Looks like that bell's driving the, uh, whatchamacallit. I am uh, breaking this farm. I'm putting us in so much danger. <clears throat> that thing is all too tight for my bare hands. But they're gonna see that I've stolen the multi-tool. Why is nobody seeing that I'm doing yeah, that do it. terrible things right now? They're gonna be like, hang on, hang on. I hope you close that entire thing up. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this will take forever. Hey, buddy, are you okay? What happened? Oh, gosh. Is there anything I can help you buy? I'm going into the barn now. I'm going to go look at some cows. Maybe it'll give birth. And it'll be beautiful. And 
stuff. I don't know. Frickity frack, run! Come on! Come on, little legs! Come on! Fiesta! Okay, we got this. Let's have a gander. Hey, you know all those license plates Mom, like right Dad, above the door? Time. It's dinner time! Okay, Do you think they're like from the cars that. that they've all like. Dad! Shh, Dad! Come on. on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. I hate duck at the moment. <laughs> Dad, Dad! They'll kick you in the head. Okay, let's do this real quick. I don't mean to look at it, I need to do the screwdriver. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. You're talking too much. Okay, let's do this. I've never been able to unscrew something that quick and easy. This depresses me how, like, well equipped he is. But if there is a zombie in here, I'm freaking out. Please, no zombos. Zombos, no zombie in. Zombos, no zombie in, please. I have a feeling it might be the dad. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Remember how Mama that uh, like teacher got make a trapped? Mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Feeling all those license plates are from are from victims. Well, how did I jump backwards? I was already out of the door. Oh, 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 Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse a mess. We had to block the back door they after walking. They ate their dad, upstairs. didn't they? Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody, sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, oh this God, it's gonna be leg, isn't it? I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Oh God, rubbing steak, Alan Mark. Bathroom, oh, right leg in the hall, and be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Oh, we're having steak, Alan Mark, or pasta, Alan Leg. I don't know. This dairy must have meant a lot to them before the Walkers destroyed everything. They Damn it! Baseball trophy. <laughs> Seems like it's been years since kids were playing sports for fun. It's only been three months. And his college degree. These boys aren't stupid. Oh, fudge. I don't trust Walkers nothing. Aren't getting through that thing. Yeah, booty. Can I go upstairs? Oh, I'm actually using the sink. Got well, some pills, lots of pills. Hmm. Nah, I like your beard. Oh, okay, I'm, I, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I thought it was something else to look at, not to close the door. Cross paths. We're so eating Mark right now. Um, can I go upstairs? Mark, Mark. Shh. Take it slow, bud. If there's a creaky step, run the fudge back down, okay? Run. Run. God, there is a family of cannibals. Right, don't, don't be so like carefree right now because things could go to hell. Okay? Mark, you in here? Is that blood? Mark is dead. Mark is so dead. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Oh, Mark is dead. Mark is dead. Farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. I really liked Mark. I fed him. Maybe I shouldn't have fed him. That that looks like a hidden passageway, but I've been playing a lot of Persona, so 
it's probably not. It's probably just, like, you know, salt lick or something. Maybe they'll lick it in the middle of the night, too. I don't know. God knows what goes on in farms. Uh, Mark's, like, head is just gonna roll out at me. Maybe not. What is that even attached to? Huh, where is that cord going? Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tube, saline. What would dairy farmers eat with this kind of stuff? I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Candles. Smart. What do they need so much morphine for? I don't remember what colored clothes Mark was wearing. Could they have been what was in the wheel basket, maybe? Huh, where is that cord going? I don't know. I don't trust. I have. <gasps> Close the door! Why are you so silly? They will know we've been here. Cl is this the door closed bit? Candles. No, no. Nope. Smart. Great. They. Well, we're just setting ourselves up for failure. That bookcase moves. It moves. I am telling you now, that bookcase Seems moves. Like a storm coming. It moves. Can you not see, like, behind it? It looks like there's a doorway. Mark it in that room. What the hell? Oh god, I don't want to use the- I'm gonna kill someone doing this. What the hell? That bookcase moves. Huh, where is that cord going? Let's back up out of here and go and check out that bookcase. I'm telling you, friend. It- I told you- I told you. Books, the things. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Uh, friend, you push. Mark is in there and he's missing a toe. He's missing an arm. He's probably missing a leg. I'm telling you, we're having pasta a la leg. Everyone down there is already eating, and I don't. I don't want to tell them what they're eating. Oh God. Lee. Mark, what the hell happened? Uh, brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, uh, man? Don't eat dinner. Please don't eat. Clem, don't do it. Oh, uh, don't eat that. Huh? Lee, Jesus, man, did you find something? Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? Oh God, you? look at Doc. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. What the hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. For gonna die now. In rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. And 
Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. We are not dying. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of go here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay! Lee? Lee? Don't worry, Clem. <laughs> You let go of her! Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Um, Mark? Mark, is that you? People are knocking me out! Open the goddamn door! You can't keep us in here! How did they get everyone in here? Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bare hands! You gotta find another way out of here! <laughs> you shit fucking bastard! Lily, are you okay? Open oh, this Clem. door, goddammit! I will knock the Please. goddamn Adam, door down! Stop. Am I tied up? It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. I... But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They... they didn't hurt you, did they? Where are Duck and oh, Kenny and up! Lee, those Katia. psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. They're not gonna kill, like, Duck and Katia, are they? Because they kind of need those guys. Are you okay? Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking Dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! Please settle down. I'll, I'll rip your goddamn heads off. They got caught you, Duck, Lee. Those fuckers have my family. I, know. I will save them. I'm gonna get out of here and find them. Oh my, Nelly! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? Yeah. No such luck. Damn. There's Marlis on the way. Chills are pretty sturdy. Damn, I shouldn't have been. Not gonna help. But there's no way out through the ceiling. Well, Doug and uh, Ben are okay. Open the door. You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you Don't the right know to stop people into me? Probably persons. <laughs> Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Yeah. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Dad, this isn't helping. Salt legs. Salt legs. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Ah, door's too solid. I'll, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get... Uh, <gasps> Easy. Oh god. Is he actually dead? No. Dad, come on. Dad. Oh god, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. <laughs> Has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Oh, Jesus. Later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead. Lily. Lily can still save him. I wish oh, she could. God. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. 
You both know what happens next. Yeah, that guy turned really Look, fast. Back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bit. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bit. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. He might make it. Remember what Ben said. We gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. I don't want to drop a salt lick on his head. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please I need to help, help her. I can't. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Lee. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help her. No. No, I don't think so. Okay. Let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Uh, Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all he of this you son of a bitch! Dude, you're fucking worthless, Lee. No! Kenny, I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! <laughs> Clementine did not need to see that. Are you okay? Is it over? It's okay, kid. It's okay. Don't look, okay? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? Let's get it out of Getting here. Get out of here. We're gonna get out, right? Yeah. We found a way out. Yeah. I'm working on it. As much as I hated Larry, that's a bit much. But at least they have food to keep them satisfied for a while. I really I'm glad I didn't have to do that. I don't I don't want Lily hating me. I hate her. Violently hate You're her. You're still alive, Lee. You're still alive. Larry was a good dad. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done he anything. He was just out to protect her. He was a good father. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Sorry, Lily. Well, Kenny did a good clean job because his bottom jaw's still there. He ain't munching, though. I don't want to hear it, Lee. Jesus. You think I like doing what I did? No. I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we've got to have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us is. I'm sorry to... that I just betrayed you. Look, if we're going to survive this shit, we've got to work. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. It could have been a lot worse, but I guess this is the way out. There ought to be an air behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Do you still have it? Of course they do. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. Larry's I've tea. Got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. <gasps> do you have a coin? Mm -mm. Larry had coins in his pocket. Oh, that's disturbing. Larry has coins in his pocket. Oh, Lily, I have to do a thing and be really disgusting right now. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. Sixty what cents, if I remember. My blessing to loot his corpse? Yes, please. Your permission. Do what you have to do. I'm gonna get us out of here. I'm so sorry that your dad is dead. Like, I... Mm. Oh, God. I don't wish a death like that on anyone. Any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? 
so I am like genuinely sorry. I hated your dad, like, like to no end. Huh. I still carry this wallet. First guess, correct? So good, so good. I'm just sorry that it's like, you know, up a dead guy. Okay. A ring. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. He deserves to keep that. I guess it's this pocket then. Go. I thought the wallet may have. And a dime. You know, the, <laughs> the wallet may have had the coins to unscrew things. Fudge. Muffins, right? Come on, dude. We got this. Let's get out of here. Save everyone. This unit off. We got this, buddy. We got this, buddy. Oh. Uh, oh. The AC should come down, down easy. easy. Okay, we got this. Right. Let's do this proper. Let's use the coins. It's a big coin. Are they usually that big? Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. I want to see you do this too, Kenny. Just saying. I understand that Larry was not the nicest of guys, but he still killed a guy in cold blood. He could have come back, you never know. I don't think. It's too small to cleanse. Clementine it. can fit through. Oh, what happens like if some bats are in the room? Are you okay, kid? You got to do this? I have faith in you and belief and trust in pixie dust. You know you don't have to do this, right? I know. I just want to go home. This will help us get back home. <sighs> okay. Maybe not your home, though. There is a dead body of your babysitter in there, okay? You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. I don't... I'm really hoping we can say duck and Katia. I think Mark's gonna bleed out. He's probably gonna turn. Clem, are you okay? Oh no. Clem, are you okay? Oh, thank hey, God. Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Where the hell are you going? What do you care? Kenny! Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Don't take too long, though, okay? Because we don't want to leave you behind. We're good. Okay? Yeah, this is good. I see, so... She's gonna get us all killed. She could have had a go at us at this Stay point. here. Take care of Lily, okay? She could have really had a go at us at this point. You know what the, um... End of episode one... It showed us what potentially could happen, so she could have actually had a go at us, but because we were on her side, she didn't. Because we didn't kill her dad or anything, she didn't. A noose? Are they gonna have to tank us? This room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Stay low to the floor. See if there's anything we can grab. Oh, look. They basically looked at us like we're cows and gone, this is the best bit. This is not. That's a good weapon. Gouge someone's eyes out. Also take the sickle. <laughs> Cut someone's leg off. Feed it to them. Oh. Can I only take one weapon? Look at the blood. It's a little bit of it. Mm. Ooh, indeed. Can I just take that soul? <laughs> God, what's wrong with these people? Well, I see the button. We're so totally. Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. We're gonna have to use this against someone. I'm, I'm reckoning. What's the better option? Do you think the sickle or the nose grabby thingy? Taser. Am I gonna put the sickle back? Yeah. Exactly how I found it. Um, Jesus, this is where they butcher people. Yeah, Kenny just said. Sick bastards. All of them. I agree. Oh gosh. 
What are we doing, pal? What the hell do you think you're doing? Get my family back. Okay. I have a Walk taser. Grab his gun. Good a plan as any. I need to follow him. Oh, it's Danny. It's not Andy. It's Danny. Because that's Charlotte. Uh, this feels like a whole Negan situation with this Lucille. Well, he's in the rain as well, so the taser might be a hey, really good option. What are you doing outside the barn? Oh, shit. Just guarding the place, like you said. Man, we sitting out in the rain like a damn year. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick which one to keep alive. Not the kid. I'm not lead on the trade. <gasps> Oh, I know, Mother. This is my favorite too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. What's going on? He's setting traps. Wait, talk to me. Dude, he's setting traps. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. Uh. I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready to act when I say. Yeah. See what he's doing now. Yeah. Okay. I'm. I'm. A ch oh God! Is this face is there? I'll duck. to be eaten, buddy. Being face to face with a gun like that really scared me. He didn't help me because I didn't back him up. I reckon that is actually something that happened. Was that Katia? Are you going to kill him? Uh, you see... You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. That's not going for his head, though. Damn. Should I kill him? Oh, well, he's... he's you know what? He <laughs> can turn... Sugar. I'm sorry, Clem. I'm really sorry. God, no! Gotcha! Just go. I'll keep Clem in I'm so sorry. I just... He was taunting me. He killed... He killed Mark. He was gonna... He was gonna kill Clem. He said it. I know. Taking Charlotte. I didn't even take the gun. Oh god, they have to be in the house, right? Oh, fudge. The hell? Where's that coming from? You are about to be shot, friend. Be careful. Andy, isn't Doug? it? Doug? Uh. 
Oh, I see. Doug makes a good sniper. Morse code. You almost blinded me. I'm sorry about that, but I did get your attention. Hi. We heard screams from the barn. What's going on? Larry's dead. <laughs> so lots gone on. Larry's dead. Trust him. Where is everybody? What can we do? I killed the guy. Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Jesus, that's sick. They've still My got Doc and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kitty is. All right, we're coming in to help. Thanks. No, if we storm the house, we'll cause a panic. You two try to find a way around to the back. I'll head to the front. Yeah. You got it. Come on, this way. Wait, are, are you sure? Yes. No. <laughs> yes, no. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. No, it's probably not going to be. It'll be fine. I'm not fine. I meant to say, uh, where's Katia and the boy? Oh god. Don't freeze at time like this game. Oh god. Lee, hit back! Don't come in here! Go, Brenda! I don't know what to do. Oh god, I have to go in. She's gonna kill her. I'm going to be the reason his Please. Kenny's wife Please, dies. Don't you take another step. Brit, come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Please don't kill Katya. Stop right there, I mean it. Please don't kill her. Oh, I told you to stop, I told you. I need a room. Brenda, I'm gonna kill you. Did they have they killed Mark? Please, please don't they cleaned up his blood pretty well, Brit, didn't they? Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there, I mean it. I ain't doing nothing. Think about what you're doing. You should have said put down the gun. Like I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Please let her go. Hello? Mark, are you dead? If I move, am I going to die? Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! I'm not, I'm not. I'm luring you into a trap. was obviously smart. How, how did it come to this? Just Thunder stop. lightning is loud. <laughs> Move in just a little. Don't pull the trigger. Don't be that girl. I don't want to kill you, Lee. You don't have to. Just let Brenda go. This, this dairy was your pride. Look what you've done to it. Stop. I mean it. I'm about to get you killed, lady. You let go of Br oh. I nearly called her Brenda. You let go of Kat- I know what's gonna happen. Katia's gonna die as well. She's gonna get shot in the head. I can just see it. Ah! Oh! Ah! Ah! Get out of here. I said don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurry. Oh my god. Close the door. That ain't gonna happen. Andy, don't shut up.
a bunker, you loser. Pointy, pointy. Fudge, come on, Lee, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Come on, he's gonna electrocute us and push us into it. Lee. Lee. Come on, Lee, Lee. not to do so. Okay, that makes me feel better. Is that all you got, Lee? I don't want to punch you anymore. You ain't shit. Dude, your whole family is like, dead over. right now. Fuck you. As soon as Dana Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. <laughs> Danny's dead. They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! I'm already walking, friend. I'm sorry. Get back here and finish this, Lee! No. I've already hurt Clementine enough. I don't need to hurt her anymore. No. I, I'm doing dramatic look right now. This may come back and bite me in the butt later on down the line, but... Bite me like a man, Lee. No! I liked you. Kind of. Lee. I should have spared your brother's life as well. They're getting in! She's turned. And if you had any brains, you'd just run. I feel 
terrible for some of my decisions, but... You know what? Danny provoked me, and I'm so sorry I ruined your life, Clem, by doing that. I've just, like, really broken your trust in me. Hey, I've got Lee. duck cane. I'm sorry for leaving the motor in unattended. I never thought a laser pointer would be the thing that saved our lives. I'm glad you showed up when you I'm did. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Doug, you're like well, my, we my gotta best stick friend. Together. Were they really chopping up people for food? Yeah. yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. Oh, God. Man, that is sick. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She didn't see your... I stopped her. This yeah, but then she saw me kill someone. Titan just unspeakable shit at every turn. Ugh. Were you guys able to salvage anything good from the dairy? Mm. Not really. St. John's took everything I had before the police got completely overrun with walkers. Oh, I was able to grab a couple of your things back while uh, Brenda wasn't looking. Oh, thank you so much. It doesn't video work. Camera. Do you have any use for it, Doug? It's just a basic camcorder. The save lot's cheapy. Let me check it out, see if I can get it working. I love you, Doug. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. You still got shot. Right, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. I'm sorry, Kenny. I'm very sorry. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You know, you know hero. hero. You destroyed two lives in that meat locker. Damn it. That was really nasty. Kenny, you're not a bad man, but fuck. What the hell are we gonna do now? I really didn't mean that as nasty as it came out. Damn. I have ruined my friendship with Kenny. This is... really crap. Come on. I've ruined my Stay relationship close. with Clem. Lee, ruined my relationship with Kenny. I didn't have to. I shouldn't have done it. I shouldn't have done that. They were very bad men, Clementine, but that doesn't mean I had to kill them. Yeah. Why did you? He provoked me. That I is like the truth thinking. behind I it. I was angry. I was scared. But I did the wrong thing. You should never kill anybody unless you absolutely have to, okay? I'm so sorry, Clem. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? What noise? Sounds like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. That sounds like guns. slowly oh god things are gonna go to hell and back aren't they i understand why the bandits were like really mad now please don't die please don't die please don't die please figures oh crap baby you gotta see this it's a shitload of food and supplies back here. <sighs> That's good. This food could save all of us. I agree. Not all of us. <sighs> Maybe I should have taken the fall for that. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back... Then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. Let's leave them with a box this then. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? I have no idea. Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. She's right. 
Maybe we'll just do a better job of rationing it. Besides, where are the people? Why did they just abandon everything? It's locked. I no have shit, the key. I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Yeah, you're right. I was just being daft. Sorry, Kenny. Can you hear all that movement in the background? Or that, like, kind of... Supplies? Raises concerns it. for me. More supplies? More food in here. Oh, there's loads. I'm, like, kind of concerned there's going to be some secret in... I want to know what's in here. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. Thanks, Ben. You're a hero. And this a hoodie. Looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. It's okay, Clem. Hold on to it. Well, think of it like you're holding on to it. You can give it back if we ever meet up with him, okay? Okay. I'm sorry, Clem. It's everything. I know we're terrible people, but Here, we need Clem, to survive too. Some batteries? Can wait for the walkie talkie. Hey, Lee. You know that camcorder? I got it working. You might want to see this. Could have done with that camcorder a lot earlier. Well, crap. Let's see this what's in store for us. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listened to a damn word I said. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Yeah. Sometimes, yeah, they do. You're so full of bullshit! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort all this out, all right? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Oh my god. Things are about... to hit the fan. Oh, okay, so we've got more positive... Oh god. <laughs> we got more positive uh, attributes this time so we savior chopped off david's leg we should have left him because he turned on us didn't he interrogation i didn't shoot jolene but you and 87 percent of players had danny shooter which i prefer <laughs> uh pragmatism help oh, help kill larry you and 68 percent of players didn't help i didn't want to kill larry revenge kill both of this 
Oh god. <laughs> kill both of the St. John brothers. You and 82% of players didn't kill both St. John brothers. I didn't want to kill the second one. I already ruined Clem's life with the first one. Survival stole the food from the car. You and 55% of the players stole food from the car. Well, I think it was the better option. It keeps us alive and going for a, a while at least. And it didn't look like anyone was coming back for that. Though now the bandits look like they may be on our tail. I don't know. Oh god, well that episode was just full of mess. I'm really sad about Mark and the fact that I've ruined my relationship with Kenny and Clem. I'm really not happy. Like, I'm really, really not happy. But anyway, that's episode two over with for now. <laughs> episode three looks like it's going to be a hoot and a half. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, please hit that like button down below. You know I appreciate the support and I hope you have an amazing, fantastic, spectacular, brilliant and beautiful day. And I shall catch you guys later. See ya.